All right, so now I've pulled her out of the cage and put her onto the jungle gym here in the middle. And she doesn't have a lot of experience out loose um, in this environment, so she's going to be more interested in exploring than she, than she is probably in interacting with me. Um, and that's to be suspected and, and pretty normal. Um, let's see. Hi. Mimi, come here. I don't think she knows her name, um, so she, you could easily change her name. I'm not even sure if it's her original name or, or who gave her that name. But hang tight. I'm going to take you for a little walk here while I grab a feather wand and see what we can, we can get her interested a little bit. So at about two, and remember we, we guess their age, um, we use history and then we use their teeth and body condition and everything. I think two is about accurate and the vet thought so as well. Going to be pretty playful, pretty active, pretty energetic cat. Um, so we're seeing that, that's good. And I'm seeing, a, again, I don't see really a shy cat here, so I don't know how that figured into her history. I see... Um, you know, play behavior, sometimes we don't see that for a couple of weeks. So uh, the fact that we are seeing it um, here after about a week with us is really a good sign. And that's, you know, she's still going to be very kitteny and very energetic. Um, so I do think this is a lovely cat. I think she has a tendency to be overstimulated.